In this video, we're gonna talk about the different PVC materials. And we're gonna start with the thickest material, which is an 80 mil. And there you can see with a quarter for a frame of reference. This material is really thick. It doesn't bend well. If you do bend it, it wants to go right back to its home position, which is flat. So you would only use these in a static mount situation where something's gonna be flat. And also this material is quite expensive because of its thickness. So rarely used uh, by Econ. Our next material is a 40 mil material. And here you can see with a quarter as a frame of reference. This material um, is more on the heavy duty side of what we use for curtains. And it bends fairly nicely. This would be used on heavy duty projects if it's outdoors for a more commercial heavy duty use type application. Um, and our next is a 20 mil, or I'm sorry, a 30 mil material. And here's a quarter for a frame of reference. This material, like all the other materials, very clear, bends very nicely. This is one of the more common materials we see in outdoor applications. If you've ever been to a uh, cafe that has a fold, a roll down clear curtain, it's usually either this 30 mil material or it's that 40 mil material. And then next up we have a 20 mil material. This material, very flexible. There you can see as a frame of reference for thickness. This goes on a lot of our indoor industrial curtains and also some residential uh, outdoor curtains for patios. So it's thinner. It's definitely the most common material for industrial indoor applications. And uh, it's the most commonly used clear material by Econ. And then finally we get into a 16 mil material, which you can see here. This material is fairly thin. It actually is used on our portable uh, shades and portable screens. This material, is it's still fairly strong but it's it's not something you're going to want to use outdoors it's definitely indoors only and um, it's a it's a very inexpensive material so definitely for light duty applications and applications where it's not going to be interfaced with a lot so hopefully that helps you choose the different pvc materials for your application if you do have any questions just contact acon and our staff can help you choose a material that's right for you